Look at this. I got headphones <laughs> on. I got a mic going. <laughs> Baby. Uh, if only people could see you now. <laughs> hey, no video. We've gone through this before. All right, no all video. right, all right. <laughs> Welcome to This Commerce Life. This is a podcast aimed at small, medium entrepreneurs focused on commerce. I'm Phil, your host, and Kenny, your co-host, will join us as well. And we're going to talk to you about the world of retail and commerce and how things are changing in the world. Hello, sir. Hey, buddy. How are you? Can you hear me okay? Yeah, it might be me. <clears throat> Hear me okay? No, I can hear you. Okay. Oh. Uh, exactly. Been, What's going on? Oh, I've been sitting here for a while. I just, yeah. There's, um, yeah, there's a lot going on. Um, but, but good stuff going on. Like lots of like really good stuff going on. I'm content planning with a bunch of folks. Um, I got some pretty serious bids out right now. Um, there's a, oh, what else is going on? Um, content planning, content planning, content planning. Lots of yeah. it. You know, I mean, we're, we're at the end of, essentially we're at the end of uh, 2012, 20, 2012, 2018, yeah. right? So it's kind of get ready, get things set for, yeah. for next year, figure out what you want to say to your, your, um, your audience and, Figure out what that looks like, you know, all that kind of stuff. So, um, I did it too. I, 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 I told you, I, I, you know, after I think not last week, yeah, might have been the week before, or maybe it was last week. I don't even know how it was. Is I thought, you know what, I signed on to WordPress. I thought, you know what, I'm, so I transferred the domain from GoDaddy to WordPress. Went through today, so I guess I just you got to sit down and uh, I, I, I put a shell of a web page together. You went to WordPress. Look at you, man. You jumped right into the deep end. That's amazing. Yeah, but they got Good those what calls can things, and I mean, again, it might not be. I mean, you know, yeah. I, check it out. I saw it's. I think it's um, um, well, it's, it's the CDMC services dot wordpress dot com, but and it has to be dot wordpress right now because it, yeah, until yeah. the transition of the of the domain, so yeah. it's not great. I mean, it's, I don't think it's brutal. Oh, it looks good. Well, I mean, I don't think it doesn't look good, but I'm trying to write it. You know, and I'll rewrite, I'll rewrite it. You know, I know you're not supposed to publish into your right? I don't give a shit. You know what? Nobody's a boss of me. Okay. I do what I want. Well, unless Amelia says I'm not. <laughs> That's a different story. You're, um, it, it look no, honestly, it looks good. Like I it's like, the, I like the header. I like the logo. Um, I like. Focusing on the needs of small CPG companies, entrepreneurs. Yeah. That's searchable. Yeah. Um, key. No? I think you're, I think you're <laughs> about you as a, a little long. I'd probably break it up a little bit more. Do you know? Like, like the about you is it's actually really good. I, I think it's, so it's written really well. I gotta figure out how to move it. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, because I think you know the highlight I mean? of services provided could probably pop up faster. Like it should go. I think it should go somewhere else. I think it should go somewhere. Well, I think what should happen, that should just come off this page. Yeah. Right. But again, you know what it was when you're writing and then I can, I thought, you know, and then I'm trying to, I'm trying to move it. And you know, listen, I'm not a WordPress expert by any stretch of imagination. And I just got to sit down and, you know, have enough patience to, to do it, which, you know, that's another story. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that's, that's the (laughs) thing about WordPress, right? Um, so work with him with anything when you don't know what the hell you're doing, right? It's the templates, right? Like, you know, sometimes they're good, sometimes they're not. Like, there's no way to, t- I don't know. If, uh, I think I can move um, it, my friend. I think I can move it. It's just, you know what? I got to spend 10 minutes and move I, it. I'm sure Kent, when Kent listens to this, he'll be screaming at, at his phone. So, Kent, if, if uh, you want to jump back on and, and explain some WordPress, um, we'd love to have you. Uh, but, uh, yeah, because I, I think, yeah, it's just the templates, explain. right? Like, you know. Explain. Screw the explain. I'll give you the Pascal. Just go. <laughs> I don't. Yeah. 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 That guy, um, Kent's, you know, Kent's a guy that we should give a plug to. He's, he's been listening to us pretty regularly and he's left hubba. So he's, he's looking for, not his good for him. Big, Not good for know. hubba, but good for Kent. 
Yeah. But so if you uh, if you need the probably North America's top five SEO marketer, Kent's your man, Ken Fenwick. Um, he's he's at least that in North America. I I think in the world he's top ten maybe. I I don't know who the top. I don't even know if there's a ranking for top SEO person in the world, but there is now. Um, there is now, right? So Phil just made it up. I just made it up. Kent's in the top ten. Top, top ten. So, yeah. I heard. You know what? I heard of a reliable source. Yeah, top yeah. five in Canada. Top look ten at world. That. Look at that, Kent Fenwick, yeah. top ten SEO marketer in the world. And if we keep saying it, so someone will believe us. Yeah, 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 yeah. And and what Kent doesn't know is we're actually just building him his own consultancy all over again. I think he had one at one point in his lifetime. We, we've just resurrected and started it. So well, why not um, though? You know, Kent Kent is uh, is now up for hire. If uh, if you want to find him, you you just contact this Commerce Life and we'll get you hooked up. And uh, you gotta go through us though. <laughs> you gotta go. <laughs> uh, we, our job we gotta protect Kent. Okay, we we don't trust a lot of people. Now now hiring for uh, Kent. Maybe I gotta be way to go through things. We take care of Kent now. You up to the left here and uh, <laughs> take a number. Take a number, take it easy. Them, you know? But we talk when we're ready. <laughs> and we got to be in the room. <laughs> we got to control this a little bit better. <laughs> it's like all these people. You know, Ken, I don't you know. You want to get some nice, are, you wanna, but, uh, you're in Canada? You, baby. <laughs> exactly. You're in Canada. You want to get stuff manufactured? Yeah. You go through us. We know people. We'll introduce you to Linda when we're all together. Well, Linda's different. So with Kent, it's like, Kent, we got a couple bunch of folks you got to do. With Linda, it's like, um, excuse me, ma'am, are, are you busy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, can I, that's come, in? Can I come in and talk to you for a second? We- <laughs> you mind? <laughs> spare a moment. <laughs> oh, my God. That's so oh, true. Man. Oh, man. Uh, what's going on with you? What's new? Ah, oh, this week has just been, uh, was, we we're doing a ad. We're so late, so late, but because, uh, we're just trying to get, you know, when, you know, small companies, when you're trying to get systems in that have never been there. Yep. <laughs> so we're still working on 2019 ad planning for, um, small independents and distributors. Mm-hmm. I mean, we're way behind, but Right now, it's almost getting to the point where it's an exercise for 2020. Getting the template set, getting the idea set, getting everybody used to this is how you have to do it. Wait, like you you guys are you guys are too late in terms of the way you've set up your ad structure, or you're talking about retailers are late for where? Well, where we we're we're really late for retailers. I mean, if you think about it, there's retailers. There's some retailers that have probably locked up till June. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. I mean, there's small independence that you could probably get February now still and March. Yeah. But if I mean, you're still yeah. just working on it and you've got hundreds of retailers, you know, so it's going to get to the point where you're segregating between A, B's and C accounts where yeah. the A's might get individuals and the B's, yeah. the top B's might get some individual and the rest would be yeah. either a, um, a generic flyer or, or yeah. a bill sheet of some kind. But you know, it's like everything takes time. Right. Yeah. So, so if you're listening to us, um, what we're talking about, you know, ad planning, if you, if you talk to any of the big guys, so whether it's, you know, the, um, typically we, I think we think grocery is when we go here. So the law laws of the world, the whole foods, Walmarts, those are London's the shoppers, um, London's been shoppers. married for three months already. Yeah. Yeah. All of those guys plan anywhere from three to six months out. And so, you know, if you're sitting in December going, hey, I'd like to get a flyer with Loblaws, you are talking about June, July already. Yeah, um, if at all. Yeah. yeah if yeah. at all. If you're, it might if not you're, even be in 2019. Yeah. It might be a yeah. 2020, uh, a 2020 yeah. play, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I mean, um, the big brands, you know, the, the J&Js where I come from and the Proctors and those guys, they start their 2020 planning yeah, because we're at the end of 2018. So they start their 2020 planning in January. Oh, yeah. Really like a six-month process. So by June, mm-hmm. they know what their uh, 2020 plan is already. Um, you know, so they're kind of ready for these guys. So if you're a little brand, don't despair. If you, if, <laughs> It is December. So maybe don't despair, but feel some urgency. And then what yeah. you can do for 2019, though, is be ready because there are always moments where... Um, 
a company can't deliver, they're out of stock, um, they've fallen There's out of favor. Something. There's always a moment. Always something. So I would I would keep you know keep, keep plugging. you know keep plugging and then and then always have. We used to have like the backup promotional plan. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Like the like the yeah. one. Right. And so, you know, it's almost like imagine if you Kenny was the buyer and you ran into Kenny at the mall or you ran into Kenny, you know, uh, running errands or something. And Kenny went, hey, listen, you know what? Those J&J guys, they totally screwed me on something. So I dropped them from the flyer. Uh, I didn't realize I was running into you. What do you have that that should go? Well, right. And you I've done that. should have that like you should have that one where you go. This one is the one that I've I've literally been sitting around. It's it's the sticky note that's been stuck to your body for the last you know four totally. years. And totally. it's like bam, this is the one, right? And then so you should always have one of those. Um, As right? a buyer, you know yeah. that I you know there was times where you know the deadline for the ad is like at London used to be two weeks yeah. out. Yeah, um, and there was on the, you know the, literally the eleventh hour something was going to yeah. short your thinking off. Yeah. I need a pickup. I need something that's already shot in the system, ready to go. And then what it was, it was a couple phone calls and behave. Yeah. You have something. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got this, this and this fine. Yeah. I'm, yeah. And so they know too, right? Like, Friday like ready. Thursday afternoon or Friday morning. And it's like, Hey, what do you got? Like a sales guy worth their salt is like, I got this. Oh, absolutely. I, mean, 100%. I, I got this, right? Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't worry about it. I got you covered. I'm, I'm, I'm getting out of here. I'm going to the cottage. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm celebrating yeah. for the weekend, right? Yeah. So, got you covered. Done, done, done. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. But it's, 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 you know, but that's, again, it's a lot easier said than, than, uh, absolutely said than, than yeah. done. Right. Yeah. But anyway, that's the, that's the last three days. Like literally okay. the whole day has been that. Dude, and then I started really, farting around with the yeah. forecasting spreadsheet yesterday for another person. And I got two, two appointments tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's been good. It's been, it's been, it's, it's, you know, it's, yeah. it's good, man. I, you know, it's, you know, I'm just thinking of, you know, of Kathy's story. You know, it is, it's, I just wake up every morning and, and yeah, I, 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 I like starting the day. Yeah. I am um, kind of a nice feeling. Eh? Yeah. No, it's, it's, I don't uh, regret going. I don't regret going. I don't dread going. I kind of like, okay, let's go. Yeah. Bouncy bouncy. I know. I like it. And I, I wake up <laughs> almost with a, a set of tasks in the day. Right. Cause you're kind of yeah. like, I gotta help that person today. Yeah. I got to do that thing for them. I got to do that thing for those guys. I got to do this thing for those guys, you know, and, uh, you know, and off you go. Right. So it's yeah. kind of cool. I, I, yeah, I, I, I like it. I mean, I have, yeah. Shit though. Yeah. Wow. You know, um, one of the most rewarding things I did this week was just to help, uh, one of my customers is running, um, a sale this weekend. And, uh, and I said to her, why, why are you running a sale? It's Christmas. Like they're going to come and buy it anyway. And she said, well, you know, we want to make sure we scoop up anybody that, you know, is, is kind of on the fence and not really. And I went, all right. It's not price, but it's not you know, price, my dear. But it's not, it shouldn't be price, right? It's not. Well, you know, so, so I, all right, you know what? Let's, let's, let's do some, let's do some fact checking. So, um, she sells through Shopify. So I, I, um, she gave me her Shopify, um, login. So I logged in, wandered through her sales data and I haven't done this in a while. Right. Like, but I liked it. Like I wandered through her sales yeah. data discount levels and I came back and went listen like you've discounted anywhere from like 5% all the way up to like 35% she was like yeah and I go any guesses what's your th price threshold like what's what's the elasticity on your product she was like yeah I think about 20% you know so so this sale we're thinking of going 15 to 20% her number was somewhere in the 5 to 8% range do you know what I, mean? I said to her you're not you're not a sale product. All you need to be is not, to just you know. be made aware. Yeah. Yeah. That's all I, probably, you know, and most yeah. people like that. Yeah. Most. Yeah. Well, I mean, you know, you're also, you're also like, you're at peak season, right? Like, I mean, this is, you know, if you're truth checking your product, this is, this is the time, right? Because if you just called it out and you showed them you're not dead, right? And you're able to feature your product, like, it is the height of consumerism right now, right? So if you can't sell it right now at full price, you're, you know, yeah. You gotta we think went through this today with the people the, I was with, yeah. right? We started, we're going to put some ads in December. I said, why? Yeah. Well, it's busy. I said, yeah, exactly. You're leaving money. Why do you need people? to give it away? Yeah. And I said, our, 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 our product is, is an everyday product. Yeah. 
like who gives a shit? Yeah. I said, if anything, what we yeah. should be doing is telling the retailer to raise it a buck. Yeah. Because nobody's looking at the price of our product right now. It's blind. Mm-hmm. You know what they're looking for? A DVD. Not well, that's, a, that's dating myself. A laptop, a yeah. television, an iPhone, a, 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 a Samsung watch. Yeah. That's what they're looking for. You yeah. think they give a shit about a loaf of bread, a bottle of vitamins, a shampoo? You just got to be in stock right now. That just, is the, that, that is the only thing. Game, you need to worry be in about. stock and put yeah. a couple extra signs up. Yeah. Full pot. That's it. Yeah. And if anything, raise the damn price. Yeah. Yeah. You're good. This is your time. Yeah. Right. It, 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 most people, my friend, most people in December, if you, all, if you just put regular price signs up yeah. in your store, you will get a sales increase. Yeah. You get yeah, it yeah. anyway. Yeah. You get that in February, the worst month of the year. In yeah. December, it's a, it's, it's a gravy train. Yeah. Because nobody gives a shit about it. No. Seriously, you're so freaked out about getting presents. The last thing you need to worry about is, is the everyday shit. Yeah, I know. Seriously. I, 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 it, we, it's funny. We just had the conversation today. Same thing. Yeah. Yeah. They laughed. I said, raise the retails. Phone your retailers. Raise your retails. Yeah. 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 So I, you know, so I, so we did this thing and, and I said to her, I, you know, you're a little brand, but you know what you, what I need to do actually is write your rules on when you need to promote yeah. and when you shouldn't, you know, and she went, what do you mean? I go, we used to do this all the time, but we used to do it for retailers, but I need to do it for you because you keep getting in your own way. Like you're exactly, you know, you just cost you yourself know like, you, know. you know? Yeah. And she's like, well, I already scheduled it. And I, so I, I made her cut it back. It's going to be 5% and no more. Yeah. And even then I said to her, look, you're leaving money on the table. Like you yeah. shouldn't, you've left the 5%, you know? Yeah. You shouldn't have. Right. right. Like, yeah, I mean, if you, you, you could, you could have, if you, let's say she's going to sell an extra $500 in a month, it doesn't matter mm-hmm. what the product is. Mm-hmm. You were better off to give $250 a Google. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And just tell yeah. the world about your story. Yeah. Cause you know what you probably would have done. Yeah. You probably would have sold $500 more. That's the extra science, right? Like that's yeah. literally yeah, that's all you had to do. Science. You're yeah. better off to take yeah. the margin giveaway. Yeah. Throw it into, um, whatever type of advertising. Yeah. It could be just a cool write up. It could be something. I mean, seriously, yeah. what? Yeah. Again, depending on what your product is. Yes. If you're electronics, yeah. if you're, you know, that stuff that we yeah, don't yeah. need. Yeah. You need to do something. Yeah, anything Bluetooth right now, you should put a discount on. I would that's say that if you haven't started, if it's not selling, yeah. don't wait. Discount yeah. it now and tell the world. Yeah. Get out of it. Yeah. Yeah. But if you're a vitamin, a bottle of shampoo, a loaf of bread, no. I would have. Full price, extra. Full stuff. price. And if anything, oh, seriously, I would have probably raised yeah. the prices. I would have started raising prices mid November. Yeah. And then discount them yeah. toward February when all the visa bills come in and people yeah. are freaking out. Yeah. You yeah. can make money for, for another couple months. And you don't need, it's not gouging. I'm not saying go freaking Looney Tunes. No, but I'd raise prices a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Right? I agree with you. I agree with you. And then I'd rather do that and, and, and then give someone a deal on, on a treat. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Where they're actually really going to want it. And it's really cool. And it's a, you know, that's, that's what, yeah. that's what you do. Why, why yeah. am I doing it on everyday shit? The, the one thing she did do that I really love and, um, this is where the social media stuff is kind of cool is I would say that if, if you're a brand out there and you have any sort of social intention or, or you're on social media, this is a great time of year not to do the discount, but to give a giveaway. Oh yeah. Um, even better. You know, like a giveaway. Like, so, um, everybody does 12 days of Christmas, right? Um, and uh, it's funny cause Mutlux is doing 12 days of Christmas. <coughs> I think they just finished, right? Cause it's the 13th today. But, um, you know, and, and Marianne, the owner said, oh, I don't know, you know, we never get interaction. I said, you know, um, the marketing person said, you know, let's try it right now. And you should absolutely do this. This is going to be wicked. And they got so much, um, we call it user generated content. So they basically went, okay, free thing today, you know, best picture wins it. Right. And every day they did it. And every day they got something like 15 to 18 posts of people posting pictures of funny dogs in boots or in whatever. Do you know what I mean? Like, and now they can reuse that all year round. Like that's like, they literally got 15 to 18 photos that they can reuse I mean, what you do know, every day, every day for 12 days, right? Like that's, that's like over 144 pictures that you can use, you know, throughout the rest of the year. Right. Like that's no like player, gold, right? gold, baby. That's gold. Exactly. And what did that take you? Yeah. Nothing. And, and honestly, you know, yeah. I, like giving something away, you're giving yeah. it away at your cost. Yeah. It's not full yeah. margin. 
Yeah. It's not degrading the, uh, de- nope. degrading the brand. Nope. It's not well, screwing and, up and, retail and pricing. And you got a fan, right? You got a fan. Absolutely. So, you know, like, yeah. Yeah. So if, if you're doing that this time of year, giveaways, any of that kind of user generated stuff, a contest of some sort is amazing. You know, yeah. Like, and again, people, you know what it is too. And, it, and what it does for a lot of people is if they get lucky and win a few things, a few pennies more in my pocket. Yeah. 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 Right. To buy something else or to do whatever yeah. you want. I mean, we're going to spend yeah. it, but you know what I mean? Like, but, but, yeah. um, and the funny thing is like, if you do it online, um, if you are an online business, uh, actually, if you're a bricks and mortar business, you do it as well. The chances of somebody walking away with just the free thing is almost nil, know. you know, because you know, they do the math too. They go, well, I got this free thing. I'm going to get a couple more things. I'm getting free shipping anyway. I'm getting the free item. They're going to buy. So I'm going to throw, if I, if they throw one more item in there, you've sold an incremental item, right? So exactly. You're there, you exactly. Know, so, yeah. 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 I mean, honestly, it's, it's not, it's not rocket science at this time. You have the traffic. Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah. You have it. Take advantage yeah. of it. Like, yeah, totally. Right. Totally. I mean, really, there's really no reason to, to yeah. blow your brains out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. People got to do what people got to do. <laughs> yeah. I, I said the same today. That was, it was funny. We had the same discussion saying, I don't do it. Yeah. Just don't, right. don't bother. Do something else. Do anything else. I know? like, I like the giveaways. I like the contests. Yeah. I do. Yeah, I think I they're just too. fun. You know, yeah. and in today's world, it's really not rocket science. You don't really have to do much of anything. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. People you know, follow ready. this, follow that, yeah, like, ready, this, like know? that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if ideally I like the fact, you know, it, it's hard to get people sometimes to do it, but you know, a picture or tell me why you like this or tell me why you want this. Mm-hmm. Recommend the friend one is always good because yep. friend will see it. You know what? And the friend might come and like it. Yeah. It's like anything mm-hmm. chitter chatter. It's, it's, there's, what's the cost? Yeah. Not a lot. Like, it's such, especially when it's a free good. It's yeah. Cost of goods plus shipping. Exactly. You know, you get an incremental well, item, it wiped out your shipping. You restrict, if you're in Toronto, yeah. restrict it to, 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 if you're Mississauga, restrict it to Mississauga and deliver it. Yeah, you could do that. That's all it is. Like, it's like anything, whatever. I don't care what you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's true. Anyway. Wow, very cool. Plus yeah. Today, you can't so, mail anything because uh, who knows who's working this week. Oh, my gosh. You know, right. the strike's over, but it's not, right? It's not over. Uh, you know. They're way behind, right? I don't think to max capacity and it's not that's not a shot to uh um you know that's not a shot to lazy workers i mean they're, they're, they're trying to get what they can yeah, get and yeah, yeah. and i get all that but it's, it's just been piling up right so it's but sure it's, it's a million like, miles behind now yeah i was in the post yeah. office the other day mailing some stuff and, and uh the postal lady said to someone yeah you're really the odds are pretty slim on regular right now that's going to get there and i'm thinking it sounded like it was going to toronto and needed 12 days i'm like you gotta be 12 days yeah, yeah. 12 days it should make it to italy well, so they're I mean, they're just turning on, you know, because I think a week before they settled, they had said to every country, stop sending us mail, right? Um, you know, because they couldn't take anymore. So they basically closed the border. So uh, not only are they clearing backlog, but as soon as they got mandated back to work, they had to turn back on yeah. countries that had stuff piling up to come to Canada, right? So, so think about this. Christmas yeah, presents that aren't going to make it. I don't yeah. get, this is first world problems. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a lot... Yeah. There's a lot of other things in the middle that people yeah. read. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. I saw in the other day, there was people, well, passports yeah. that maybe had travel booked and, and passports yeah. were going to be like That's right on the fun. wire. Yeah, yeah. Right? Now you're yeah. talking, you know, potentially losing thousands of dollars. And I know that doesn't mean anything if you don't have, have the money and there's other issues you're worried yeah. about. But for those people, it's a big deal. It's yeah, it's huge, right? It's it's like sitting around and waiting, right? Like that's all you can do too. There's no other way well, to, you know, there's no way to track it. There's no way to. Nothing. You can't do anything, man. You just, whenever it comes, it's going to come. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy, man. Crazy. It's maddening. Maddening. Crazy. So maddening. what's going on now for the rest of the week? What the way the, the weekend? Um, Busy week next week? Well, next week. So next week I leave. I leave on the 18th for Mexico City. Nice. Um, I'm still working. I'm, I'm still going to be working, but. I just assume that. You know, yeah. Um, but uh, so, so this weekend is going to be. I've got to, I've got to clean up shit and get stuff done. I've got to mark. I've got um, students marks. I got to get in before I go. So I got to do all that this uh, tomorrow morning, tomorrow morning. I'll be marks, um, you know, all that kind of stuff. And then, 
me, the smarty pants. So um, Montlux got approached for an ad in a magazine and they, they said, yeah, yeah, this is a good idea. And I went, yeah, it's a good idea, but you're paying for an ad. Let's go ask for editorial. So we can write an article that goes with it, right? So anytime, oh, um, that's kind of, that's a pro tip. So anytime that you get approached to put uh, an ad in a magazine, um, if you have any sort of ability to write an article of some sort that uh, makes you sound smart, that goes right beside the article where, okay. or, you know, right beside the ad where you're advertising, you should take it. Um, it allows you to be um, super intellectual or um, add value without having to sell anything because your ad's right beside your article. Um, so it's a really great place to just hit extra placement. Um, so we did that, um, except, you know, somewhere along the way I realized, I suggested the article. I'm probably going to be the one writing the article. Well, I just assume that. So, yeah. <laughs> I, you know, I have dumbass moments, right? So I was like, yeah, oh, it's an article. It's not a book. No, yeah. No, no, no. It's like, you so, know, yeah. I mean, an article nowadays isn't even what it was before. It's no. like 500 words. Yeah. I don't you know, I mean, it's not, really, it's not 10 minutes because no. you got to think it through and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's a couple hours. It's not like it's going to take you the full no. day. You know what? Honestly, if I do it while I'm driving, it's, it's about a half hour. I because I I do things um, orally. Phil's not so. writing while he's driving, by the way. No, he's talking into a hands-free yeah, device. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so I'm doing it safe, safe, and then I yeah. but I do I record myself because um, I yeah. think better when I'm talking, and then I come home and I transcribe myself. Yeah, I got it. Uh, Just wanted to make sure we clarified that so the Ontario police <laughs> are looking for this dumbass who's got a pen and paper. I wasn't on the phone, Our man. Ontario police are not worried about me right now because Rob Ford's trying to hire his friend. Um, you know, who doesn't qualify to be the superintendent. So you guys voted him in. Enjoy the ride, baby. We, we did. And Enjoy we got the ride. All right. Like they, they, um, this guy didn't qualify. So they changed all the job descriptions. So he would qualify. Hmm, sounds uh, like a neighbor to the South would do. You know, yeah. 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 It's, uh, it's madness. Anyway, the whole thing's madness. All good in the hood, baby. All good in the hood. Whatever. Head. You know, whatever. All good in yeah. the hood. So did you record tonight? Or are we doing this tomorrow morning? Not writing? No, anything? no, no. I recorded. I recorded. I recorded. Yeah. This is this is us sounding actually pretty fresh. We we had some pretty good laughs in here, and you know, nah, it's, yeah, it was, it's I, yeah. it's yeah. I mean, I'm still kind of, you know, still kind of reeling from the first part of the conversation. That's I know. I, know. I just love. I love. I love that man. I just. I you know how excited I get when I hear shit like that. Oh, just, I'm I'm so yeah. excited. I, I think so I'm more scary. excited than she is, right? Because I yeah. was like, well, she's probably scared shitless, and you're just thinking, go, yeah, go, go, go jump, jump. You know, and she's like, ah, uh, you need to calm down. I'll figure it out. And I'm like, all right, yeah, sure, however sure. you go, you know, however you do this, I'm here. You know, like, that's awesome. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I think it's awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty cool, buddy boy. Pretty, pretty cool, cool, man. Pretty cool. Um, tomorrow, um, I'm with the students one last time. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to do, I'm going to do a screen capture or I like a screen record yeah. of the whole thing. Um, so you can see, yeah. um, but they, I think they've done a pretty good job, uh, with the new images and then with happy? The all the retailers, I'm happy with it. Um, so I will, I'll record it and send over the link. So record, can... send it to me and send it to Dominic. Yeah. You have Dom's, okay. uh, email do, address yeah. as well. Yeah. Yeah. And let us yeah. take a peek at it. It'd be okay. awesome. So I'm going to, I've got beans in Coquitlam, um, early morning. Yeah mid-morning and then i'll be in east van again in the afternoon okay. i'll go see dominic okay. and uh let's take a look at it okay very cool man that sounds very good cool. that sounds good yay um okay. i think that's it Maybe. yeah i don't got anything else for you either yeah. i gotta go fix my web page i get my domain name WordPress. put on property now wordpress 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 Jeez, I know, honestly. yeah baby all right that's the end of this commerce life we'll be back soon with the next episode thank you for joining us we hope you enjoyed it uh, give us feedback. Tell us what you think. Subscribe, like us, join us, share us, tell your friends about us. And uh, we hope to see you next time with, uh, with more commerce news.